Oh, nice animation. Tutorial, the skirmish. Welcome to cards. Attack and destroy the German headquarters at Arnhem before the enemy reinforcements arrive. The enemy starts the game. Enemy infantry spotted. The enemy just deployed a unit to the battlefield. Let's hope you draw a good card. Your turn. Your first infantry unit. The 506th Airborne is an infantry unit. Infantry units can either move or attack each turn. Start by deploying it in your support line. Drag and drop the card on either side of your headquarters. Front line taken by the enemy. The enemy captured the front line and is now in position to attack your HQ. Attack the enemy unit and halt the enemy advance. Oh, nice. Infantry can only attack into the next battle line. Capture the front line. The front line has been cleared of enemy units. Advance your units and get into position to attack the enemy HQ. Infantry can only attack into the next battle line. Do I do this? I understand. Okay, alright. You have drawn your first order. An order card can be used only once and is then removed from play. Use it wisely. Triggers a one-time effect when played from hand and is then removed. Gunship Assault. Deal two damage to a target in the enemy support line. Or can I... Uh... Oh my god, I love this game! This is so cool! Victory. Yeah, stick it up and congratulations. Click continue to start the next tutorial. Tutorial. Credits. Playing a card from your hand costs credits. You also play credits when your units move or attack. Here's my credits down here, I guess. My turn. You gain a, gr a credit every turn. Infantry can only attack into the next battle line. I, love, I even love the background. Look at this. This is like a, an army issued um, jacket or something. Credits are the resources that you use to play cards and operate units, move and or attack. The cost of each card is displayed in the upper left corner of the card. So that costs one unit. Whereas that will cost three. Okay. Infantry can only attack into the next battle line, so. Uh huh. Uh, it says. You need more credits before you can play this card. Okay, so do I just end my turn? Or shall I move forward here? And protect the HQ. Let's try that. I see. So I'm keeping cards in my hands. He's keeping cards in his hands. You now have enough credits to attack the enemy with the 506th Airborne or deploy another infantry unit. You cannot do both. Uh, no, I don't. Oh, I do. I do. So these do four damage. They do four damage. 30th Regiment, 115th. 506th Airborne. So I could attack them. 
they can use that card without losing any credits. Okay, I think I'm going to deploy... Precision Strike. You have drawn your first tank unit, an M5A1 tank. Tank units can both move and attack during the same turn. Okay. So I could move. And attack. Oh. Units need a turn to get ready. Uh, they can't move or attack the same turn in which they come to play. Okay. So I could attack here. Okay. Alright. Oh, wow. Air Blitz deals four damage to the enemy HQ. I've only got four health left. Right, that's pretty pretty bad. Uh, I am going to advance. Advance. And so that did a lot of damage. Did three damage. They're down to five. They're still in a better condition than we are. I can attack here. No, it's already moved, so I can't utilize that now this is free triggers a one-time effect when played from hand and is then removed what does this do give a ground unit plus one or plus two must target a ground unit not so i can't fix the hq up so if i'd have done that before i could have taken them out completely all right let's see see how we get on I'm liking this. What do you think, guys? I think this is so cool. Oh, we got a gunship. That can deal two damage to a target in the enemy support. So. What happens if I just attack? Because we do five damage, right? victory congratulations you have finished the first two tutorials get ready for the next phase so i'm a little bit confused um because it seems quite easy to send an airplane over and blow the hq up there must be a way of protecting it or repairing it when it gets damaged i imagine i imagine i imagine is a new word Hello, welcome to Cards. You have now completed the basic tutorial. Select a starting nation and unlock the starter decks of all the other nations by defeating them in battle. Oh, I like it. I like it. Well, I'm going to have to obviously be Britain. The vast empire was caught off guard when war broke out, but adapted quickly to new types of warfare. With their formidable fleet, advanced aircraft and incredible stubbornness, the British forces never gave an inch without a fight. The British also had an ace up their sleeve when it came to the gathering of intelligence. For the Allies, this would prove to be one of the mightiest weapons of all. I love everything about this game so far. I love the artwork, I love the animations, I love the audio, I love the game. I'm really, really enjoying this. Select an enemy. Wow, it's got to be, isn't it? So I've got to beat the USA as well. Select a deck. Uh, so the only one that isn't locked is the Britain starter deck. Read the card description carefully on your cards and enemy cards. Many units and orders are most useful in specific circumstances. Okay. Mulligan. The Mulligan stage takes place at the start of each battle and is where you are given the option to redraw your starting hand. Select the cards you wish to replace and they will be replaced with random cards from your deck. AA Barrage. Target, target air unit must retreat. Give your HQ plus two defense. I'm keeping that. 
The Lancashire Fusiliers, I love this artwork. Deal five damage to an enemy tank. Keep calm and carry on. Cup of tea. Give your British units plus two defence. Well, I'm quite happy with all of these, except we've only got one unit to attack with. But okay, I I don't know what I don't know what's good and what's not right now. But these all sound very positive to me. So you got twenty health on your HQ. That's interesting. Guard. You have just drawn a card called 5th Brigade, which has the Guard ability. Adjacent non-Guard units cannot be attacked except by bombers and artillery. So cards next to these guys cannot be attacked except by bombers and artillery. But they can be attacked head on. Okay. So I've got 1k. Hmm. That's going to cost me 4k to deploy them. Okay, I see a problem. See my first mistake. We have to get lucky on the next card, I think. They've taken the front line. Um, Fury. You have just drawn a card called Humber Mark II, which has the Fury ability. Units with Fury can attack twice each turn. Alright. Yeah, I thought I'd try it. So they've got a direct line to attack me here, I guess. You, I'm guessing you can have multiple lines of front line. Maybe not. Are they going to attack me? Deployment. The enemy has just played a card called 4 Pioneer Battalion, which has a deployment ability. Deployment effects trigger when the unit is deployed from hand. The deployment ability of each unit is described in the card text. Deployment. Give all friendly ground units on the front line plus one defense. Okay. And they attack you. So I've still only got 3k, so... Probably should have deployed the 5th Brigade, shouldn't I? It's a guard. But I need 2k to do that. So I haven't got enough credits. Okay. I mean, I'm going to make mistakes. Oh, what's this? Does this tell me what's coming next? What am I looking at here? Oh, these cards that have been played. Okay, I, I understand. Oh, we might very well lose our first battle. Oh, that looks important. Gain five additional credits next turn. What? Blitz. The enemy has just played a card called Panzer 2A, which has the Blitz ability. It can operate, move, attack. At the same turn, it enters the battlefield. What? Okay, but he, he can't attack me because he's not in position to do so. Convoy HX175, draw two cards. That cost me 3k. I've got to get some... Uh, I've got to get some units out. Okay, so they've lost control of the front line. What else can I deploy? Got 1k left, so all I can do is this an AA barrage. Okay, uh, can I play that? Have I got to attack a unit? Must attack an air unit. Okay, I, I get it, I get it. So they're going to get five credits now. Look at that, they've got 10 credits and we've got one. Fighter, the enemy has just played a card called M. E BF 109E, which is a fighter unit. Yes, it is. Fighters prevent enemy bombers from attacking other targets in the same battle line. Is that all it does? My enemy has taken the front line and they've attacked us as well. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. We've just spent 10k. Right, so we've got Humber Mark II to tank. 
bring that in. Uh, this is our... So they're a guard unit, right? So this is our attack, this is our defense. Okay, I get it. Uh, so I've got 3k left. What can I deploy? Right, that should see us through until we get some more K. <laughs> I hope. So they can also attack. Okay, I didn't realise that. So these are a guard unit as well. We've only got one health left here. This is not good. Okay. So I think the Lancashire Fusiliers need to come into play. We need to get rid of these tanks. I have 1k left. And the only thing I can do is the AA Barrage. So let's do that. Nice. And we get a bit of extra HP as well. So it looks like we're playing a very defensive game. That's the British. They're back. So they do quite a lot of damage, but they've only got one health left. Get rid of them. Uh, let's... Get rid of them. Can they fight twice? Can they fight twice? So they've got Fury. Is that Fury? Yeah, that's Fury. Okay, that's what that means. Uh, yeah, okay, I've already attacked twice. Uh, so I can do five damage to an enemy tank. That's not a tank unit. Fair enough. Uh, we can bring in the 5th Brigade. We can draw two cards. Alright, let's play this. <laughs> The Balok Regiment. Uh, three attack, four defense. That's nice. 26th Engineer Regiment. Oh, I love this game. This game's so cool. But we can't move. So let's go to the next. I had a feeling they might do that. Okay, I need to work out how to get into this. Heavy Armour. You have just drawn a card called Churchill Mark IV, which has the Heavy Armour ability. Unit receives one less damage when attacked by other units. Unit can have Heavy Armour 3 maximum. Okay. Uh, so let's... Oh, my card's gone. So every time you use... Okay, so every time you use something, it gets less health. That's interesting. I like this. It's very clever. Oh, what? Again? So I can deal 5 damage to their tank. Take the front line, and I've still got 5k left. So let's play that, and we've still got a chance of 
So we've got another Churchill. Another Balak Regiment. So, let's see if we can actually attack them for a change. Um, let's get rid of their tank. Now, will he attack me again? Yes, but that's all right. Smoke screen. The enemy has just played a card called Panzer 2A, which has the smoke screen ability. Unit cannot be attacked by enemy units. A unit loses smoke screen if it moves or attacks. Units in front line cannot have a smoke screen. Okay. What do we get? So we've got lots of Balak regiments. Uh, if I attack there, it's going to take two health down. So, okay, I'm going to go So the 5th Brigade are uh, a defence regiment. Also going to deploy that gives HQ plus two. There we go. This one. We have to go up to four. That means I can attack and not lose my unit. Oh, I didn't lose any that time. Well, that's interesting. Okay. So we've done some damage. Technically, we're winning. <laughs> Technically. Oh, the Lancashire Fusiliers. They look pretty tough. Um, which one's a guard unit? Oh, there we go. They're guards. So, if I move up, then these can only be attacked by artillery or bombers. And what do they have? Guarded. Ah, I see. They're guarded. What's this? Heavy armor plus one. Oh, this is cool. I'm getting it. I'm starting to see stuff. Still got 9k. What can I deploy? They look pretty handy. 5k left. I might hold on to that 5k for the next round. Because they've got 12k. So, I mean, they could do a lot of stuff in a short amount of time. We're in a pretty good position here. Blitz. Oh, what does that do? Fighters prevent enemy bombers from attacking other targets in the same battle line. Cool. Holding on to that. So, uh, I think it's time we actually attacked. So let's push up with our unit. They're defended. Uh, let's really try and hit the enemy if we can. I'm pretty happy with that. Can anyone... Does anyone have Blitz? No. We've got 7k left. Uh, I think we're in a pretty good position. They can only do one damage each, so... I'm not too scared of them. They should be very scared of us, though. Do you know what? I suddenly feel like we're going to win this. Artillery! You've just drawn a card called Six Pounder, which is an artillery unit. Artillery receives no damage in return when attacking. It ignores guarded status. Uh, we'll play that. Faux shizzles. Oh, 
Ah, oh, I thought that was it. I'm pretty sure we've got this one. We just deployed the Panzers. I don't think it's going to be enough. We just got Blitz again. Double Blitz. Uh, this should be it. This should be a victory. The Germany starter deck is now unlocked. And we leveled up. The Desert Rat. My grandfather was a Desert Rat. Deal one damage to an enemy unit and pin it. What does that mean? And pin it. That means it can't... Oh, pin it so it can't attack us on the next turn. That's very cool. Nice. Well, okay, guys. Listen. Uh, first look. What do you think? Tell me in the comments. I think this game is absolutely superb. Uh, it's They sent me this key to review it quite a long time ago. And, uh, you know, stuff gets in the way. And it kind of fell to the back line. But it's always been on my mind. I've always wanted to take a look at it and see what it looks like. Because it looks so good. It's actually better than I thought it was going to be. And I think this is brilliant. So, uh, yeah. Let me know in the comments what you think, guys. I think this is an absolute winner. Thanks for watching. Take care. Till next time. Goodbye.